Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Kowalski. These rosters are absolutely loaded. Filled the amount of talent. Let's see what's in store for this Hunt matchup. Opening face-off just moments away. The Red Wings will start with the puck as they win the opening face-off here. Cuts to the paint. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Both enders work so much on their reaction time. And man, this is just a clinic right now as he flashes the glove and makes the save. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Quick shot. And that goes off someone in front that doesn't reach the net. Kucherov's got it in the offensive zone. Scores! And just like that, a perfect road start. A cliche is always getting the start, but that is exactly what it means. And the coach couldn't have drawn it up any prettier to take the crowd out of the game early and send a message right from puck drop. Well, this is just a fabulous shot. When you're in that high slot area, you know that you're going to be closed upon quickly, so you got to have a quick release. That's the first thing. And the second thing is the accuracy. If it's quick and it's on, you're going to score. The Red Wings were looking for a good start in this one, and they have certainly accomplished that with the first goal of the game just minutes in. Well, you know they would have talked about making sure that they established some presence and some pace in the game, in particular in the opening frame, James. But to get up a 1-0 lead on your opponent just minutes into the game, that is a fantastic start. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Driving right to the front. Denies him with the pad. Across the line, along the left wall. Here's a shot. And it's stopped by the club. Nice play there. Offense is on base off, and he wins the draw. Puck grab by McDavid. Fires it on it. They score. but you have to execute. That's two in a row. That puck comes off his six so fast, the goalie can't get a read on it. It's in the back of the net. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Red Wings have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And now it's grabbed by Mayu. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Moves it quickly over to Forte. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow. Gets it out of his own end. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Pittsburgh's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the pass. Takes a shot. Denies him on the slapper. Quick pass across to Pasternak. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. More than half the period left to play. 2-0 is the score. Gretzky's won the draw. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Comes up with a monster save in front. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Nylander's moving the puck through his own zone. Here's a chance! And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. The Panthers take it across the line. Coughs up possession of the puck. Moves it to Ajo. The Red Wings looking against the half wall. Grabs the puck in the slot. Here's a blast. Oh, what a stop. Quick feed to Cote. And he takes the feed. Takes the feed. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. And that's poked away by Dobson. Skates.
Bounce across the blue line. Here's a shot. And there's a glove save on the play. The Red Wings have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Drives it to the crease. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Hammers one. Scores! And they're cooking now. Uh, the opponent has no answer for them right now because they're relentless on the puck. They garnered some momentum after multiple back-to-back -back goals, James. They don't want to leave any breathing room and let their opponent get some life back. Well, that quick glove hand looks like a windmill, James. I think that was meant for the highlight reel. Unfortunately, you gotta catch the puck if you want to make it there. The Red Wings came hungry to play this one, and they lead as a result here in the first. And off the draw at center, they take control of the puck. The Panthers will play it in their own end. And he's taken down. The officials are signaling for a penalty. Well, in this situation, he is going to get the tripping goal. I thought he had good position there on his opponent, James, fishing for the puck. Just used his stick, and it got into the skates. Tripping is the call. Pittsburgh's getting their power play unit out for the first time tonight. An opportunity on their first power play of the game, James. And this is an opportunity to look at the coverage as well, see how they're playing it, whether they're going to be aggressive or sit back. All alone! Oh, what a save! Let it perfectly! Oh, he knew exactly what he wanted to do, James, but wasn't able to sell the fake nice save by the tender. So how's that for killing a penalty? That's turning a PK into a power kill, James. Not just shooting it down the ice. You have time and space. Take advantage with the shorty. You see players taking a shot all the time in practice with their skill coaches. And I'm telling you right now, this is perfect execution. Shooting in stride, quick snap of the wrist, and putting in the back of the net. Got to see where you want to be. His head was up the whole time. Korshak's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. The Red Wings take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. Nylander's got it against the boards. Here's a blast! Oh, he couldn't put it past! What a stop by Gooby! As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Kucherov's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Red Wings take possession here inside the offensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Nylander. Decides to go to the backhand. And a quick save on that one. Oh, tremendous save on the play. What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Pittsburgh's got it in the wrong zone. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Pittsburgh's coaches will not be liking that power play opportunity as they fail to convert and give up a shorthanded one. Nice save from point blank range. Goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Tries to the paint. Gives them nothing in front. Here's a shot. There's another consecutive save. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. The Red Wings have a big lead already here as we near the end of period number one. They have certainly come to shine tonight. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Hughes will play into the corner. The Red Wings take it from the side. Big save just as time runs out. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action, stick around. And the opening face-off here in period number two is about set. 
Here we go. Lots of time left in this one, but certainly a lopsided affair to this point. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? The Red Wings have been urgent right from puck drop, James. I mean, they first on the puck, they're hounding it, they've been relentless, they've created a ton of turnovers. It's a reason why they're ahead. Lots of time left in this period. It's 4-0. This has been a one-sided affair right from the get-go. Made that stop. Cuts into the paint. Scores! And that's three. It's a hat-trick here on the road. Well, old hat for him in a way because it's a business-like approach as he's on the road. He just says, yeah, just bring it. I mean, gets a hattie to boot. I'd like to call this a quiet shot, James. What that means is the goaltender can't see it. So it's listening and it buzzes right by him because he cannot catch up to it, can't find it with his eyes, and can't find it with his body. The Red Wings have already created a mismatch here tonight when you look at the scoreboard, Cheryl, but they're not taking the foot off the gas. No, they're not, and every time they have an opportunity to shoot, they're putting it to the net, and a lot of confidence for every player here when they get the puck into that offense. Scores! Another one, and listen to these fans now, Cheryl. They don't like it one bit.
shot the puck, James, but he elects to deke, and when he dekes, he just isn't able to outweigh the tender who's able to make the save. The Red Wings have been on fire offensively tonight, and they lead for good reason here in the second. McDavid's Continues. Listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud, and 
recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. Hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. And there's the save on the play. Great heads-up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Oh, my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will to get to the end. They James, the game is more than X's and O's. Sometimes it's emotional leadership that comes into play, and that's exactly what this goal means to this entire event. Just so you see everyone erupts when he scores. Off. And he takes the feed. Steps into the offensive end. The Panthers scoop it up along the boards. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. And yet another penalty is called. So out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Pittsburgh's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. When the power play is struggling, you gotta get a screen in front. The purpose is to open up more lanes where the shooter gets a better look and the goaltender can't see. Matthews plays it into the offensive zone. Oh, and I think that goes off the mask and it stays out and play continues. I've never been a goaltender except in road hockey, James. But I tell you, if you take one off the mask, you gotta be rattling. But nonetheless, he finds a way to get the save. And that's what you gotta do. Put everything in front of it if you wanna make the stop. Blocked in traffic. Scores! Go shorty! It's a short-handed one at that! And this could be a turning point in the game, James. I mean, when you're on the PK and you look to attack like they did, that's unbelievable to recognize the opportunity to jump. But man, did they jump. And they end up capitalizing off of it. Of this PK unit, they jumped, they attacked, 
isang basa ang hibig. for the drama next. Drop the puck on period number three. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Two thirds of the way to the finish line in this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? Pittsburgh's got to have a fresh start in this third period, James. They haven't been urgent and they've been chasing the entire game. And I could tell that right from puck drop in the first period. They weren't urgent off of the faceoff, they weren't where they needed to be. And it's looked like that all game long. They need to change it now if they want to get back in this one. Mayu stick handling in his own zone. Inside his own end moves the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Forte. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. And it's a quick pass to Kote. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. The Red Wings have been the busier team offensively, and as a result, they lead it big time here in this third. Off the face off, they take the puck. Kucherov's got it across the line. All alone! What a save on the play! Oh, James, I thought he had it. He was out, and he could have faked and moved the tender, but he got it himself in a little too tight when he made it. And man, what a nice save. The Red Wings have been active all night in the offensive zone, and they lead it here in this third. Gretzky's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Takes it into the slot. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Here they come, down the left side on the attack. Shot, blocker saved by Gretzky's. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. A chance! Oh, another great save right there! You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back-to-back. -back. The Red Wings can simply take this on cruise control based on the lead that they now have here in the third. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Big time save! And he scores! And there's the hat trick three as the magic number. It's a magic number. He's doing everything he can to take the crowd out of this one as he's with the away team. But he's been dominated, playing really confident all night long. You can just see the weight shift, James, there in that slap shot where he's able to just peg it as he walks into it and beats the goaltender low six side.
Pittsburgh's got the puck at the defensive end. Handles the pass. Moves it to Jaeger. The Red Wings have layered well today and really protected their goaltender. We've seen everything. They're so close to the shutout. Yes, it's a superstition, but this team has played so well defensively. It's not just a goaltender stat, it's a team stat. Tendy's gonna hang on and get a whistle here and a reset, much needed one at that. Oh yeah, I mean, they have just been taking control of in their own zone, James, and they needed this reset. They needed the goaltender to pounce on that puck. They can all collect themselves and get a line change. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kucherov. Goes right to the crease, and that's blocked. Let's the rest of the
Less than 60 seconds. Oh! puck drop and they finished at the same speed. I'm James Sabalski. Good night.